we will be using the, the, the Molly Kitchen. Uh, if you have some special recipe that you want to also upload, then it's going to save in the database. Or if you can upload it for everybody to share, or you can even sell it in the recipe. First, he was uh, doing the recipe, and his hand movements were recorded by our digital motion. This is a robotic kitchen which uh, can cook any kind of dish and any kind of variation of dish. Uh, with, uh, I hope one time without any limitation. So it means you can choose the, any kind of dish from any kind of chef in the world and take ingredients inside and cook everything automatically. So basically now the, the hand does everything was Kim uh, did before. So you can bring up the kick. We'll, uh, love to, uh, we'll enjoy uh, watching robots cooking. So what works with the technique? If the chef is very popular and the people want to try his dish, they can, they can buy, upload it. If you are a regular customer, you can just save it for yourself for, and make just sharing to everybody. So it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a flexible platform to exchange the content. And the content is a script for the robot. Cherry tomatoes in butter, a little bit of salt and pepper. You add a splash of vermouth. We're turning the heat up. So. Uh, remember that this blender is normal to blender, but it's usually... When I first was brought into this project, I thought, oh, kitchen robot, uh, that's going to be like a Swiss army knife. That's something that I thought we would have to cheat on, I thought uh, we'd have to get both. But it's actually a ladle, the same way I would. It even wipes the ladle. It's very small, because it has a lot of water, and you can see it is a little bit. It's got some truffle oil, very strong truffle oil. The truffle oil, you don't want to overdo drops. That's exactly what it will do. From the installation, uh, it will be a plug and play device, uh, which potentially will be in the six different blocks, which can easily put together. And after that, it makes an automatic calibration system inside, like any kind of printer do now. So you just plug in, put the cartridge, press the button, and make some automatic calibration process, and that's it. I hope it will be. I hope that the cost is nice. Then everybody can afford it. Then everybody can enjoy their life, right, without the cooking. Really futuristic and uh, technology advanced. And the price is a little bit steep, but over the long term, if there was a chef cooking every night, it would far uh, surpassed uh, the cost of hiring someone. Yeah. Yeah, exactly the dishes that you want, quite unique.